With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The question is the sum of all the values of x between 0 and pi, 4 pi will satisfy the equation sin x into under root of 8 cos square x is equal to 1 is k pi. Then the value of k divided by 5 is equal to. So first let us see our equation. We are given sin x into under root of 8 cos square x is equal to 1. We can write this as 2 root 2 into sin x into cos x is equal to 1. We have our identity of sin 2x that it is equal to 2 times of sin x into cos x. So if we apply this here we see that we will get 2 under root 2 into sin 2x is equal to 1. So the value of sin 2x comes out to be equal to 1 upon under root 2. Now we know that the value of sin pi by 4 is equal to under root 2. So from here we will get 2x is equal to applying the general formula. This will be n pi plus minus 1 to the power n into alpha. Alpha here is pi by 4. So the value of x will be equal to n pi divided by 2 plus of minus 1 to the power n into pi by 8. And here our n goes from 0, 1, 2 to infinity. Now in the question it is given asked to find the sum of the values and the range of x is given between 0 and 4 pi. So now we know that the value of n can go from 0, 1 and so on. So first if we will put the value of n to be 0, we say that this term will become 0 and this will become pi by 8 plus if we will put the value of n to be 1, this will become pi by 2 minus of pi by 8 because odd power of minus 1 will give minus of 1 and even power of minus 1 will give plus 1. Now if we put the value of n to be 2 we will get 2 pi by 2 plus pi by 8. Putting in the value of n to be 3 this will become 3 pi by 2 minus pi by 8. When we put it to be 4 this will become 4 pi by 2 plus pi by 8. When it will be 5 it will be 5 pi by 2 minus pi by 8. When it will be 6, it will be 6 pi by 2 plus pi by 8 plus when it is 7, it will be 7 pi by 2 minus pi by 8 and when it will be 8, it will be pi by 2 plus pi by 8. Here we see that now if we cancel this out, this will be equal to 4 pi and plus pi by 8 which gives us the value of x to be greater than pi by 4. And in the question it is given that it can be less than pi by 4 only. So we will not consider our last term. And here if we see that minus pi by 8 will cancel by plus of this. This will get cancelled by this. We can cancel this by plus of pi by 8. And lastly this will cancel out by pi by 8. So we see that we are only left with pi by 2 into here we see that we have pi by 2, 2 times of pi by 2, 3 times of pi by 2. So what we can write this as 1 plus, 2 plus, 3 plus. So on till the last term is 7. So this will be plus of 7. So this will be equal to sum of this will come out to be 28 into pi by 2 which is equal to 14 pi. Now we see that in the question it is given that this value is equal to k pi. So we can put this to be equal to k pi. So comparing we will get the value of k to be 40. And now in the question we are asked to find the value of k by 5. So this will be 14 divided by 5 which comes out to be equal to 2.8. Therefore this is our required answer. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.